Hello guys, in this video, we will create app service in Azure portal and we will enable app insights for it. Then we will create ASP.NET Core web app in Visual Studio. Basically, when this app is run, it will throw an exception. Then we will deploy this app into Azure app service. And then we will cross check that exceptions or logs from this app are not written in app insights. So basically, I just want to show that though we have deployed this app into app service for which app insights is configured still exceptions or logs are not written in app insights and for that we need to do some additional custom changes as well and those changes we will do in our next video so guys we are in azure portal and let's create our app service so app services create web app let's select resource group i will give name as my test app service 22 runtime stack as dot net 8 operating system windows let's select free pricing plan let's go to monitor and secure and here enable app insights so let's say s and let's create new app insights let's give name to this app insights so i will say my test app insights 22 let's say okay review and create and create so app insight has been created let's say go to resource settings configuration and here let's enable scm authorization so i will, so I will select on and let's save continue and now let's go to the visual studio and create our sp.net core web application and then we will deploy it in this app service now guys we are in visual studio let's select sp.net core web app next let's give name to our project next let's select dotnet 8.0 and create you can see our app is ready now let's expand this controller folder let's open home controller and here in this index method i will add this line so basically this line number 18 it will throw an exception because this is not a valid integer and let's simply run our application and see if it throws an exception and yes we received the exception let's stop it and now let's deploy this app to the app service which we just created so right click publish azure next azure app service next let's expand this and yes this is the app service which we just created let's select that let's say finish and let's say publish and you can see the publish is successful and now let's go to the azure portal and let's run this app from app service we are in azure portal let's say home let's open app services my test app service 22 and here let's click on browse and you can see when we executed this app we received an error okay and now guys though we have enabled app insights for this app service we will check that the logs for this exception are not written into the app insights and let's cross check that so let's click on app insights and let's open this my test app insights 22 our app service is configured with this app insights let's open it let's click on failures and now we waited for a few minutes we clicked on refresh as well and you can see nothing is logged under failures similarly if you go to transaction transaction search as well and if i say last 30 minutes here also nothing is logged so that's it guys and in our next video we will configure app insights for this asp.net core web application 